July 2022 saw Doughty Moriurara return to the stage on which it all began. Nagoya, the host of his first official bout 19 years ago. Back then, Asa Shoryu topped the chart and tabloid headlines for damaging Kyokushuzan's driver's car mid-feud. And Mori won that first bout against this man, Zen Daisho, who retired just weeks ago. Alas, that was the falsest of dawns. Now, as then, is he in Division 6, but on the highest rung, which is worryingly close to much demoted Asanoyama. I confess my journeys to watch the ex Ozeki train and interview him made me miss Mori's first three losses, which were not epoch making. His wind drought continued in match four as Tamawashi's teenage colleague Tamano Tora stood him up with head first charge, pinned with left arm, and neutered his breaststroke defense. Match 5, though, saw him withstand the charge of Dai Eisho's junior Dai Tensho and shape to cut inside, before lugging his left foot too far across and leaving his chest exposed. But though evil spirits may enjoy his foot stamp massages, Mori is no weakling. And against 16 year old Soga, colleague of Nishikigi, did his charge hit the spot at nice leaning angle and bring his 245th career win. Yet better was to come at the end, as Waka Arata, short of success himself, was skillfully armlocked and pressed from the right for victory 246. A lot of fights to win in any form of life, let alone against men who are actually strong. Respect then, as ever, to unyielding Moriurara, who is sure to be back in September of this year, next year, and beyond. Although Takakesho is his stable group's head wrestler, this is no impression. He simply values a tidy samurai look.